Hello, my name is Mighty High and welcome back to another Redstone video. Yes, today we are working on a wishing well. Yes, that's it. Uh, yes, you can clearly see a wishing well behind me. It's not just any random water feature, uh, but that's what it's supposed to be, a wishing well. So the idea on today's Redstone video and the idea came from Sonny, uh, who I play on the Unorth Block server, is that you chuck an item in here and then you get a random amount of items back. I say random, but you get some items back anyway. I'm not 100% sure how we figure this one out, but I'm sure we can figure it out pretty easily. So to start off with, we probably want to sort our camera out. <laughs> get some redstone on my hotbar. So I think first thing we should probably do is chuck some hoppers down here. Shift click them on like this so they're all pointing towards each other. So if we just chuck them all in here, they should all go into the middle one and then down into this one. So that's all good. Uh, so now we want a few more hoppers going this way and then anything that turns into this hopper would go in down here as well but it doesn't really matter so yeah and now what we want to do is take a comparator signal probably from that one gonna have a comparator output from this hopper here so anything let's just get a light so anything that goes past that hopper should get picked up. Yep, yeah, and that's staying in there because it's in there. But yeah, that's cool. So now what we could do is, I mean, what we could do is have it on a randomizer, but we should probably have this going into a chest. Uh, so yeah, anything that goes into this well here like that <laughs> chest will just end up in there again cool uh and then what we could do is we could have this on a randomizer so we have a dropper uh we could have that there and then we have a hopper going into that dropper and then if we put like three stackable items in there and then we want let's say one non-stackable item uh, diamond chest plates fine and then we want three blocks out I think one two three and then we can have our torch there so let's just let so let's just get a lever out because that'll be easier to test this and so what's going to happen is the item in this dropper is going to be spat out and then go into this hopper and then immediately go back into this but what we want to do is we want to have a comparator outside this hopper so depending on what item goes into the hopper is dependent on the redstone signal uh, so we've got a signal up to three which would be this diamond chest plate here and i think these hoppers will only give one as well so let's test that and we get one 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 three so yeah that works fine so then what we would do is we would come down here we can chuck our diamonds in there did we get anything no we didn't let's try again do we get anything yay we got a diamond Woo! awesome <laughs> Uh, so that's the basic principle of it and then what we could do is get some half slabs on these hoppers and just cover these hoppers up so they don't look that bad. We've got ourselves a water fountain and diamonds. We should still be able to get the items through. Yeah. So this is the basics of the redstone but I think we could do a lot better than this so one thing we could do is extend or at least yeah extend this pulse so it gives us a longer pulse uh that a longer pulse of redstone which means that we could power this dropper for longer and get more items out of it and we could probably do something with the actual item we chuck into said fountain as well or wishing well Oh, hi there. 
I know you're uh, halfway through this video, but uh, please consider subscribing because I do videos like this on a weekly basis. Anyway, back to the redstone. I think we've done it. So this could be done in many different ways. This is just the way I've done it, although I could possibly do it other ways, but that's probably for another video, eh? Uh, so in this chest we've got a wide variety of items so let's just grab all of these and see what works so let's just try chucking some gold in there uh, gold no what about copper no no copper uh, redstone maybe no I mean a mending book come on no not even a mending book well, let's try some netherite then. Not even a netherite ingot would work. What, really? Come on. Okay, fine. Let's just try some diamonds then. Of course, fine. I'm only going to chuck one in though. Nothing. Still. All right, so I think we've got it working now. I just had to change the way these hoppers were facing. So they're facing all the way here and we also want hoppers like that as well so they're going past this item filter and then into this box here so now everything should be working fingers crossed that is and then if we chuck a diamond in yay <laughs> we get loads but uh, one thing that I did forget to do is I've just got uh, a non-stackable item in there so we could probably add three more items in there and then we'll get a one in four chance of actually getting something so if we chuck that in there we actually got something then uh, but then again, there is a chance not to get anything. Like, that time we didn't get anything. Uh, that time we did. Awesome. And you get 14 items out of it. Cool, that's not too bad, actually. Uh, and this is the redstone underneath. So it's uh, not as compact as it could be, but it's as compact as I could make it. Um, and it's fairly simple. It's basically just an item filter here. Uh, these are the items that we're uh, filtering down so these are the items that we want to be given a reward for and then all the other items should be in this chest here nice awesome i'm pretty happy about this uh so yeah so what other redstone contraptions do you think we can make uh put it down in the comments below and also subscribe if you're not already Anyway, thank you very much for watching. My name is Mighty High. If you like this video, then please click the like button. And if you really liked it, then click the subscribe button and ding that bell for further uploads. I'd be Mighty High, and thank you very much for watching. Good.